Hey, it's Joe here at Red's Fly Shop. I'm gonna show you how to fish a fly today called the Spanish Bullet. There's a link in the video description. You can see uh, really good images of all the colors we sell and get some more details. Uh, one note is I find this fly fishes really well as a contact or check style nymph. Not so well fished under like a hopper dropper rig or even under an indicator. I think there's better flies for that. This fly is a bullet. It is coated with epoxy. It cuts to the bottom, sinks very quickly but it's not overly heavy, so it doesn't stall and get planted along the bottom. I'm gonna jump in this riffle down here and uh, show you a little bit about fishing it. I'm fishing it on a 10 foot two weight on 5X fluorocarbon with about a three foot cider, so I am uh, doing a contact or check style nymph. Let's jam down here, see if I can't get a fish. I consider this an absolutely essential fly. It's one of our top flies uh, at Red's. It's an extremely high quality pattern. Again, link in the video description. Let's go fish and get into some trout. Okay, I'm fishing that Spanish bullet nymph. And I've actually got two of them on there today because it's a little bit windy. And I'm running one as an anchor fly and one as my point fly which I'm calling the point fly, the one I've got set up just above. It's a little higher in the column, and the, the reason I'm running two of the Spanish bullets is with that wind, I need a fly that sinks fast and gets down pretty good, but it's late in the fall, and I, I don't want to fish a fly that's really big or has a big bead. I want a pretty fast sinking small fly. And I'm just dropping it right. Oh, that's a nice fish. Just dropping it right back in the ripple there. And one tip, you know, I'm, I happen to be, you know, using a Euro rig today. And uh, if you can learn anything from it, is that initial, like, when I dip and then I begin to lift, that's almost always when those fish bite, is right on that initial lift. Oh my gosh, that's fun. You people should be here right now. It's November. Everybody's gone home. I got my river to myself again. And uh, a beautiful trout on. Oh, that's, a, that's a pretty good one. Let's see if I can't work him back up current here. Come, to come back upstream to you. A low rod angle is a good idea, and that tends to help them kind of coerce them into coming in head first. And that fish is on that bullet quill. That's the one with the uh, kind of the segments or the stripes on it. If I had to pick a favorite, it's hard to do. I'd say the bullet quill is my favorite, the one with the stripes. Let's see if I can coax him in here. Uh, let him run. Let me see if I can't get this this big guy in here. And there we go. So nice fish. I was wrong. He's actually on that Frenchie. That's the red and black one. Beautiful trout. 